Hello, this is your musician friend AK coming at you with the songs that you love to hear and play. Today's song is In My Name, and that's by Milton Brunson. And this is a throwback from the 80s. We're going back to the 80s, guys. And this was actually suggested by G. Thank you so much, G, for giving us something awesome to work on on today. And if I didn't say it, we're in the key of G flat that goes along with your name, G. And guys, you know what? Before we start, I have this awesome drink right here. I'm working with Celsius Heat. And I just want to get into it real quick. Let me see what it tastes like real quick. Energizing. Energizing. That woke me up. Thank you. Guys, I would love for you to go to your favorite refrigerator. Open it up. And I would like for you to get your favorite beverage. Head on back to your favorite keyboard and sit down and learn with your favorite instructor, me, AK, on today. And guys, if you didn't get a chance to hit that like, hit it right now because it brings more people to our community. Bam, I see you just hit it. Thank you. Let's get into it. We're in the key of G flat. That's G flat, A flat, B flat, B, B flat, E flat, F and G flat. Of course, this is numerical melodies. We have to run through that with our numbers. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and one. Guys, we have the awesome Milton Brunson in the building. He's warming up with his choir. They decided to come through and bless us with their awesome song, In My Name. Uh, you know what? Let's just go ahead and crack our fingers right there. Bam, crack our knuckles, stretch them out. And we have it. All right, I think we're ready. Let's learn in my name. Let's get it. Let's give it up for Milton Brunson in my name. To all my numerates, let's take this time out and count our numbers. Easy song, guys. We're going to get through it. So it kind of starts off with...
right, let me give you that. We're starting out on the two. And in our right hand, we're playing a regular G flat major chord. Going to our F minor chord. Our bass is switching up. We're going to the five. And we're on this B two or B added to, I should say. And then we're walking up from a six. We're playing a B major chord. Going to the seven, playing a D flat major chord. Ending on our G flat major chord. And they're doing this nice, beautiful motif. They're going B flat, B, D flat, G flat. And then we're playing a chord. That's a D flat major chord on the one. Going to a B major chord on the one. And ending on our G flat major chord. So guys, that's the intro. We're starting out with, I'll give you peace. When the storm is raging. Let me give you that. So we're starting out on the one, right? That's a G flat major chord on the one. And we're going B flat, D flat, A flat. And then we're playing our chord. That's a G flat two chord on the three. When the storm is raging. All right, what is that? On our four, we're playing a G flat six chord. Going up to our six. Regular B chord. On our seven, we're playing a D flat chord. And then we're doing this nice thing. They're going, all right, what is that? Playing that chord, resolving with our G flat chord. All right, you just repeat it. Ba -da -ba -ba. Ba -da -ba -da -ba. It changes up right here. Let me give you that. So this is, all this is is just a seven, three, six progression. All right, so we're on the seven. We're playing an A flat minor chord. They kind of do that, they hit it twice, right? And they're going to the three, and they're playing a B diminished seven chord. And then we're doing this, just two chords on the six. We're playing a D flat major, going to our G flat major chord. And then they go, da, 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 da. let me give you that. They're going D flat major on the six. They're walking up. That's just a G flat going to an A flat. We're going D flat major going to a B major chord. We're on our three. We're playing a G flat two chord. Just put your trust in me. All right, what is that? We're playing a 5 1 4 progression. Very nice progression. That's an E7 on the 5. That's a G flat 13 on the 1. And then we're resolving on our 4 with this G flat 6 chord in me. And you see that chord right there? Still on the 4. Anything you need, have faith in me. All right, what is that? That's so beautiful. I love that part. Anything, we're on the five, regular G flat chord. You need, we're on the two, playing a B chord. Nice passing chord right here. Have, a lot of people don't get this chord. It goes by so fast you can't really hear it. Okay, so we're on the one. And we're playing this E7 chord. Going to our seven. Now in gospel, we have this thing called seven, three, six progression. So we're playing a C minor seven on a seven. And then on the three, we're playing a B diminished seven. And then we're on our six, and that's a G flat six chord. And then we just play the beginning. Just X. go oh, oh, oh. all right let me give you that oh so first oh we're on the seven we're playing a d flat major chord then we're on our six we're playing the same d flat major chord still on the six and now we're just changing up we're playing this e flat diminished seven chord 
Just X Just X And all of this is still the same So the next part is All things are possible Let me give you that just that little piece So we're on a 5 flat We're playing our E flat minor chord and then we're going to our five regular D flat chord. Nice passing chord coming up right there. Grab it, you got it. And then we're on the E flat minor chord on the six. They have this cool little walk up they're doing. Let me give you that. We're on our two. We're playing an A flat dominant seven chord. We're on our three. Now we're playing a regular G flat major chord. Back to that A flat dominant seven on the five flat. And now we're ending with our D flat major chord. Then they have this nice little thing they're doing, nice gospel motif. You hear that a lot in gospel, especially the older gospel songs. But that's five, four, three. That's a G flat major chord. That's an A flat minor chord on the four. Going to our G flat major chord on the three. And then they just repeat. That last chord right there, it changes up a little bit. We're playing this G flat two chord. Hold it. And then release it. Going to a D flat major chord on the five. Alright, so what are we doing? We're going, we're on the three, we're playing this chord. I am the father. That's going to the six. That's a G flat major chord on the six. Going to the three. See that chord? That's a G flat major chord. Add it to. Just put your trust in me. And we already learned all this. Anything you need, have faith. Just ask in my name. Repeat. Now there's one part that goes, there is power, power in my name, in my name. All right, let me give you that. We're on the two. We're right here on the two, and we're playing a B. It's like a big cluster of a chord. <laughs> You see that? It's it's a B7 chord added to. It's just a cluster. All right. And then we're on the two. And in the left hand, I'm doing this. We have two, two, one, six, two, two, one, six, two, five, up, six. And that up is six flat. <laughs> Going to the six. All right. So there is power in my name. Power in my name. All right, guys, I hope this helped you out. Awesome lesson. Today's life lesson is karma happens. When I was younger, I remember my brother having an impressive wardrobe. He had G Unit, Rockaware, and all kinds of basketball jumpsuits. I thought his wardrobe was so cool. I became a master of stealth, sneaking out in his clothes and returning them like they never left the hangar. But this one particular day, he took my most prized possession, my car, and brought it back looking like it had been through a game of bumper cars. I learned that borrowing without permission can lead to unexpected consequences. Whether it's sneaking clothes or wrecking a car, karma happens. Awesome job, guys. Let's give ourselves a hand. Thank you so much for coming in. Thank you for blessing me with your presence. And I hope that you was able to learn a lot from this lesson. I want to encourage you to share this information with as many people as you can 
Guys, we want to go worldwide. We want to go worldwide with this. We want to bless as many people as we can possibly bless. Guys, you know what? We have a Facebook page. That is me playing all of the songs that I love to hear and play. And I hope you do as well. And we have a section that's called viewers requests yes and all that is is you tell me the song that you want me to learn and play and you suggest it and i will play it and of course that's a viewers request and that's on facebook numerical melodies and guys you know where we have a bell i would love for you to hit that bell because a video that is new is coming right to you and right next to that bell is a subscribe button some people say it takes an hour some people say it takes two days i don't know i don't know but we're going to try it three seconds. I believe it takes three seconds. Let's see. Three, two, one. Bam! I see you just hit it and you just hit the bell. Thank you. I really appreciate it. Guys, you're not just playing the music. You are the music. This is AK signing off.